Ever wondered what those digits on your flight ticket mean? Far from random, they form a structured code teeming with information. These digits reveal the identity of the airline, the airports of origin and destination, and even the date of ticket issuance. It's like a secret language whispering tales of your journey that usually fly under the radar. So the next time you board a flight, remember, your ticket holds more than just your seat number. Have you ever been denied a seat switch on an empty flight? It's a question that leaves many scratching their heads. But here's the secret. Airlines often reserve certain seats for various reasons. Some are kept aside for last minute passenger upgrades, others for crew rest, and sometimes it's all about balancing the plane's weight distribution. So, that empty row you're eyeing? It's not just vacant seats, it's a chessboard of strategic planning. So the next time you see an empty row, it's not just a row, it's a tale of untold stories. Ever notice the cabin lights dim during takeoff and landing? It isn't just about creating a cozy ambiance. It's a calculated safety measure. Dimmed lights help our eyes adjust quicker to the outside light in case of an emergency evacuation. And those window shades kept up? They're not just for your viewing pleasure. They allow the crew to swiftly assess outside conditions. So the next time you buckle up, remember, every action in the air travel world is a meticulously planned step towards your safety. Those dangling oxygen masks, do you know their secret? Often a source of curiosity, these masks hold a vital truth. They contain only around 15 minutes of oxygen, but don't let that concern you. This brief supply is specifically designed to provide enough time for the pilot to descend to an altitude where the air is breathable. The safety briefing advises securing your own mask first for a crucial reason. Your survival becomes the pathway to assisting others. In the world of air travel, your survival becomes the key to helping others. Ever pondered the source of airplane water? It's an interesting tale indeed. The water you sip on your flight comes from tanks that are sanitized, but perhaps not as often as you'd imagine. Yes, you heard it right. The frequency of this cleaning process might be less than ideal. So here's a tip. To avoid any potential health hiccups, it may be wise to opt for bottled water instead. Next time you're on a flight, remember, not all water is created equal. Ever heard the cryptic language between pilots and air traffic control? It's a unique dialect, a symphony of codes and abbreviations that fills the cockpit and the airwaves. It's not designed to be secretive, but rather efficient and precise, leaving no room for misinterpretation at thousands of feet above ground. Imagine phrases like Roger, signaling received transmission, or Wilco, short for will comply, echoing through the cabin. Then there's squawk, which is not a bird's call, but a four-digit code pilots input into a transponder to identify their aircraft to air traffic control. And who could forget Pan Pan and Mayday, the unmistakable distress signals? This language, foreign to most, is the backbone of aviation. It bridges the gap between pilots, air traffic controllers, and ground staff, ensuring everyone is on the same page, or rather, the same frequency. It's the rhythm of the skies, the unspoken world of flight crew communication. In the air, a language of its own weaves the safety net of your journey. Turbulence, a common but often misunderstood companion. It's the bumps and jolts we experience mid-flight, but it's rarely a cause for alarm. Pilots with their skilled navigation use radar and weather reports to predict and maneuver through these pockets of instability. They dance with the turbulence, leading us safely from one point to another. Despite the unsettling sensation, turbulence is usually harmless. It's the sky's way of reminding us of the power and unpredictability of nature. Turbulence is a gentle reminder of nature's whims, but nothing more. Ever been puzzled by the limited movie selections on flights? The reasons behind this aren't as simple as you might think. It's not just about what the airline thinks you'll like. It's about navigating a labyrinth of licensing agreements, regional restrictions, and cost negotiations. These factors all play a role in determining what movies make the cut and which ones don't. So, the next time you browse through the in-flight entertainment, remember, the choices may not soar as freely as the planes, but there's always a reason. While you rest in your seat, do you know where the crew rests? Through the hustle and bustle of cabin service, there's a clandestine world just beyond the curtains. This is the crew rest area, a secluded space where flight attendants retreat to catch a few hours of sleep during long-haul flights. It's a haven of tranquility amidst the hum of jet engines. Ensuring your comfort is their top priority, 
and they do this tirelessly, even when you're oblivious to their own. Ever felt the ticket prices fluctuate like a roller coaster? Welcome to the enigmatic world of dynamic pricing. Airlines employ complex algorithms that are constantly monitoring factors like demand, time until departure, browsing history, and even the device you're using to browse. Each of these elements plays a part in setting ticket prices. It's a sophisticated dance of data and dollars, ensuring airlines stay profitable while passengers can still find affordable flights. The world of air travel pricing is as dynamic as the skies themselves. 